Hello. Because the service today for January 10th was recorded before the event in Washington, D.C., and in discussion with pastor and others, it seems appropriate to have an additional prayer here for January 10th and following days in 2021. I invite you, the people of Prince of Peace, and our friends of the congregation, to join in prayer. Dear Father, the country stand, seems to be in turmoil. Be it changes in governments, violence in the streets, abuse of rights, or viruses in ourselves or loved ones, there seems to be many reasons to fear and to be uncomfortable. We turn over our fear and discomfort to you. Father, the Bible tells us that you can calm storms that you change governments, that you work to establish the rule of love and grace in the face of corruption, captivity, and oppression. Be our strength in this time. Let us be reminded to build up together, not to ruthlessly tear apart. For the people who died in Washington, D.C., we pray your comfort for their family and loved ones as they mourn. For the police, security, and other responders, we pray your hand on them and give thanks that generally calm heads and good discipline did not bring escalation of violence. For our national government, we pray for orderly transition. We pray for truth and an end of corruption. We pray for calm representation and respect of basic rights, not vengeful, vengeful rhetoric or hurtful actions. Father, there are many sources of media that we can watch, listen, or read. We pray you guide the media to bring forth facts and perform investigation to seek the truth and end corruption. So much we need good communication over blustery rhetoric. For us who look to the media for information and guidance, help us to process and filter the many sources through our faith in God. Help us to find your truth and share it with others. God, these things are in your hands and in your timing. Help us to know your strength and your messages. Do not fear. Love wins. Let us do justice, love kindness, and walk humbly with you. In the name of Jesus the Messiah.